Brace yourself for tough times there. But away from that, Amani National Congress Party leader Musalia Mudavadi now wants the Jubilee administration to implement President Uhuru Kenyatta's pledge that money borrowed from local and foreign creditors will not be embezzled or misappropriated and that the corrupt are brought to book. Elsewhere, a section of lawmakers have asked President Uhuru Kenyatta to disband the cabinet and form an all-inclusive exec executive in the spirit of the handshake. Patrick Amimo with that story. Musalia Mudavad was in Gatanga, Moranga County, where he was joined by former Gatanga MP Peter Kenneth. While in Sekur Friday, Mudavad expressed concern about the government's growing appetite for foreign loans and graft. Mudavad has expressed optimism that the president will lock the talk and ensure borrowed funds are used prudently. Asema, kwamba ye, jukumulake ni kwa kwamba zile mikopo zinakuja Kenya, zitakuwa za riba ya ku, ambayo ni njema, na tena zitumike vizuri. Na ile rungu yake ya kupiga nyoka ya ufisadi atazidi kuinua na kugonga. Sasa mimi nikasema sasa kama ni hiyo then what is the problem? Basi tuwe kitu kimoja. And at Lugari Grounds in Kakamega County, some MPs converged for a funds drive to support border border operators. The lawmaker said owing to the new found friendship from the handshake, the cabinet now needs to be reconstituted. President wait your cabinet does not reflect the face of Kenya. Utapata kwamba kuna kabila mbili ambaye imeshikilia ma cabinet positions nyingi. Tungependa kuhimiza uhuru Kenyatta avunje baraza la, mawiz, la mawaziri yake to form cabinet mpya. The MP said time to implement issues in the March 9th Peace Pact is now. I mambo ya electoral justice imekuwa elusive. When will the fruits of this handshake begin to trickle down? Exclusivity, mambo ya katiba kubadilishwa, ibadilishwe so that all the communities of the Republic of Kenya can feel included. Katuone ile maneno ya equity and equalization ya projects. Mukifanya projects kiambu, tunataka tuone project hapa lugari. Mukilipa wakulima wakahawa. They also had a word on the task force established to look into the crisis facing the local sugar industry. Because we want to be with the county government of Kakamega and the county government of Bungoma. We have to take a look at the people who are coming to the house and are coming to the house and the house and the house. Patrick Amimo, KTN News. Meanwhile,